Hello, I'm Michael Metcalf, National Commercial Sales Manager here at Pilkington UK. Glass has arguably come to define the look of the modern built environment more than any other material. From monumental city centre buildings to local car dealerships, most commercial buildings today incorporate a significant amount of glass. It's a unique material which protects us from the elements, whether that's hot or cold temperatures, wind, rain or snow, whilst also letting natural light flow to the inside of the buildings. Today, glass can do much more than simply protect occupants from the elements. So what else do you need to consider when choosing glass for a commercial project? Well, let's start with thermal insulation. This is the property of the glass that helps keep interiors warm during winter, thus reducing the need for heating. Low emissivity, or low E glass as it's often called, is designed to prevent heat escaping. Low E glass, such as Pilkington Optitherm S1, has a natural coating which dramatically reduces heat transfer and reflects interior heat back into the space. Compared with uncoated double glazing, a low E coating can make a space more than twice as energy efficient, so it has become an essential component of buildings where large portions of the envelope are glazed. Another issue that can arise when a building has large glazed areas is heat buildup. This happens when too much of the sun's energy streams in through the glass, raising the temperature inside in the same way as happens with a greenhouse. Now it's possible to limit this with a solar control coating, which is designed to filter out the invisible but high energy radiation that carries with it much of the energy in the sunlight. This means that spaces can still be filled with daylight but that the heating effect is greatly reduced. Of course, as well as acting as a filter for the light and heat entering and leaving a building, glass also forms a physical barrier between inside and out, so it's important to think about the mechanical strength of glaze systems. It's vital that the glazing is strong enough to stand up to the forces it might be subjected to from the wind, people falling against it, or in some cases, the risk of attempted breakings, manual attack, or even bomb blasts. In the case of glazed roofs, these may need to be able to support people walking or falling on them, as well as a potential build-up of snow which can become very heavy. Specifying toughened or laminated glass can significantly increase the strength of the glazing. As glazing technology has developed, it's had a big effect on the appearance and the performance of the built environment all around us. Here at Pilkington, we continue to invest in research and development work to push glass technology forward and develop the technologies that will shape glazing design in the decades ahead.